Greg and Lindsay, my challenge to you both today as you set out on this journey and establish a home and a family together is that you would take these verses and be able to put your name where love is, to be patient and kind, to not envy or boast, to be proud nor rude, to not be self-seeking but instead selfless, to be slow to anger and not keep account of one another's wrongdoings, to rejoice in the truth, to protect, trust, hope and persevere, most importantly, to never falter in your commitment to each other. Lindsay, today we begin our lives together as husband and wife. I promise to you and in front of our family and our friends to be your faithful husband. I choose to live with you Loving you when life is peaceful and when it is painful, during our successes and during our failures. I promise to love you, to work together with you, to achieve our goals as a family, and to share my life with you and the kids till my last breath on this earth. From this moment, I take you as my best friend for life. Let us be a home for each other forever and ever. I vow to fiercely love you in all your forms, now and always, and always know that no matter what challenges might carry us apart, we will always find our way back to each other. You are the moon in my night sky, my lady. I will love you forever, Lindsay. Greg, you came into my life at exactly the right time. A time when I thought I wasn't ready, but actually needed you more than I realized. I could not have chosen a better man for the kids to look up to you. Thank you for not shying away from the challenges of fatherhood and for loving the kids as your own. You have become such a family man and I could not be more grateful for that. Thank you for always being there to make me laugh even on the bad days. I've grown up with you as a constant presence in my life. One of my brother's best friends, my neighbor, and now my husband. How could I have ever known that everything I ever wanted, needed, and hoped for was right in front of me all along? I can't help but feel like Derek had a hand in bringing us in together in perfect timing, making us quite literally a match made in heaven. I promise to care for you and I will always try my best to keep a smile on your face. But most of all, I promise to be your best friend forever. I love you. And now by the power vested in me as a duly ordained minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Greg, you may kiss your bride. You look amazing. Mm. All right. Ladies and session. gentlemen, it is my esteemed privilege to present to you for the very first time Mr. and Mrs. Greg Harris. My name is Ashlyn. I am the daughter of tonight's beautiful couple. As many of you know, my mom and I have been through many ups and downs throughout the years, and I'm so proud that God gave me such a wonderful woman to call my mom. Thank you for always being by my side when no one else was. One day we were sitting down, and Mama told me that someone had asked her on a date, and of course it was Greg. I could not think of anyone better for our family, someone that had already been a part of our family for a very long time. From the very beginning, 
Being a family came very natural to us. What amazes me the most is not only did Greg devote himself to my mom, but to Brooklyn Colson as I, and I as well. He took on the challenge of a whole package, which takes a lot of courage. And I would like to thank you from the bottom of my heart for being the dad that we needed. I love you both so much, and I can't wait to see what God does with y'all's relationship.